Ramadan's already here. It's like, it's like here already. Like what happened to the time it came by so quick? As I'm recording this video, there's six days left to Ramadan. By the time it's uploaded, Ramadan's already started. And I'm like super excited and nervous at the same time. And I, I just don't know how to feel. <laughs> I thought it'd be cool though to get a chair first. What am I doing? I thought it'd be cool to vlog a week in the life during Ramadan and kind of document how I'm able to balance everything with school and you know Quran and fasting and everything that happens during Ramadan and so I'll try to post one of these a week inshallah and I think it should be a lot of fun but bro it's Ramadan oh one more thing one more thing so alhamdulillah I've teamed up with HCI Human Concern International during Ramadan to help amend the situation in Palestine. All of us are aware of the ongoing issues happening in Palestine, and this is your chance to make a difference. I'm teaming up with them to help give food, medical aid, and help rebuild homes in Palestine. There's a link down below in the description, and all of your donations will go towards those causes. So start your Ramadan off on the right foot, start it off with that barakah, and help really make a difference for those who need it in Palestine. I feel like one of those sheikhs trying to fundraise at like a whole bar or something. It's very uncomfortable. <laughs> but remember that Ramadan really is the best time to give charity. So give as much as you can. Again, the link will be in the description. Wassalamu alaikum. Actually, we'll continue with the rest of this vlog. Yes, okay, bye. Two hours later. So I am headed to soccer because I'm trying to get as much exercise as I can before Ramadan starts because I don't think I'm gonna be Working out that much or playing soccer that much during Ramadan. Um, part of it's just because I'm lazy and I don't want to do that while fasting. But also, it's like, I actually want to like focus during Ramadan. Ooh, that lighting sucks. Hold on. Six hours later. I actually want to like focus during Ramadan. You know, like I want to focus on my deen and really, really grind that out, if that makes sense. I want to really just focus on my deen and use all the time that I have for that. Like the two hours that I could use at the gym or a soccer game or whatever, I could be reading Quran instead, right? We have a lot of priorities in our lives, which is good, but in Ramadan, your main priority has to be your deen. This, this right here, this beautiful thing is going to be your best friend during this month. All of your free time should be spent reading this, yeah? It shouldn't be spent on that thing over there. Forget about that thing for this month. This is your best friend. Tomorrow. So in Ramadan, everyone should have a goal as to how much Quran that they want to read, whether it be half the Quran, the entire Quran. Everyone should set a goal to read as much as they can. And one of the easiest ways for me that I've found is to just read a couple pages after every salah, because you're gonna pray the five prayers anyways, you might as well take a couple minutes after each prayer and read a couple pages. If you read just four pages after every prayer, you'll finish the entire Quran in the month of Ramadan, just by doing four pages every Salah. So even though Ramadan hasn't technically started for me, that's what I'm going to do just to build that habit. I just finished praying Duhr, I'm gonna read some Quran, get some homework done, edit some videos, weather is beautiful outside, so yeah, it's going to be a good day, inshallah. So, uh, so Egypt just got knocked out by Senegal and we're not going to the World Cup anymore. You remember what I said earlier about today being a good day? Yeah. Yeah, that, that's not happening anymore. God damn it! So I'm editing what I have so far this vlog and it is very choppy. <laughs> I really have it filmed as much as I would have liked to. It's 11 p.m. so I'm gonna go to sleep but I'm excited for tomorrow because I'm gonna take you guys with me to school. It's gonna be interesting seeing how school kind of plays into Ramadan with having to like fast through classes and everything and exams. So I'm excited for that. But yeah, if you haven't already liked the video, drop a like. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and join the gang, dude. We got the best family on YouTube. That's pretty much it. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow. Three days, bro. Three days. Well, that's crazy. I'm actually really excited, alhamdulillah. I can kind of sense like the Ramadan vibes already coming in. But yeah, I woke up early today, alhamdulillah. I'm gonna take you guys to school with me and it's gonna be a good day. You know, there's there's this weird blessing in, in waking up early and starting your day early. Like I've, I've already gotten so much work done. I don't feel rushed, you know. 
it just feels good. <laughs> and inshallah with suhoor and fajr at the masjid, that feeling is going to be elevated during Ramadan. But yeah, let's go to school. <laughs> So, I just realized that I forgot to bring food with me, and I'm here for eight hours on campus. <laughs> so, I guess this is going to be some, like, good practice for Ramadan. But, yeah, that sucks. Two days, bro. Two days. That's crazy. It's starting to like really hit me how close Ramadan really is. I'm gonna end the vlog today just because I'm doing the same things that I was yesterday and I wanna actually upload this on Friday before Ramadan starts. But the last thing I'll leave you guys with is that it's here. It's actually here. We finally made it. We've been blessed enough to actually be given this opportunity again. So don't let it go to waste. Don't waste your time in these 30 days. Be very productive and mindful of what you're doing and how you're using your time. If you made it to the end of this video, I know you're a real one. And so I'm gonna remind you guys one more time to donate to the fundraiser down below. I'm gonna include the link. All your donations will go towards helping families in Ghazda during Ramadan. So start your Ramadan off on the right foot, inshallah. I love you guys for the sake of Allah. I'm hoping that this is the best Ramadan that we've all experienced, inshallah. And I'll catch you guys later. Assalamu alaikum.